it's been a few lads at breakfast uh, commenting uh, the distances I'm putting the, the marker flight quite easily so it was uh, thought I'd probably show you I'm going to start off with a setup as well really not just the rod there's, there's a new rod I'm actually trying out here but the marker flight setup for me is keep it simple a lot of people are putting these booms on and so forth um, for me keep it simple and if that pops up I know I can fish it so it's a simple thing it's a free spirit run ring it's got a ceramic ring in the top which makes it I mean as you can see there it's, it's about a 12 mil uh, centre that goes down onto a big bead which sits in there so it can't actually damage your knot and then marker flight of your choice obviously there I've got a, a corder one you can use any any marker flight you want but for me I do like the corder ones so they stick out well at long range it's got a 50 pound armor cord leader going through to some 20 pound braid same again you can use you can use um, any braid that you want and so forth so but for lot wise not wise I mean you can see it's a bit fluffed up there but I'm not too worried about it I'm just using a back-to-back -back grinner on that one people some people have been trying but we use the back-to-back um, -back blood and so forth but it can slip rod is it's the new LRM 13 foot long range marker I mean I've been putting this from big distances I'm only flicking it here 120 yards but we'll show you casting in a minute it's got two markers on it a foot marker and a two foot marker so you can actually obviously go in between it um, ring wise I've stuck with a 50 mil ring because that's what I prefer and it's uh, it definitely helps with, you, with the long range casting some of the reel when you mark a float reel you, you want a clutch I've, big bait runners have got the thing on the back brilliant all the Shimano ones they've got a fast drag on the front so you can actually click it on and off very quickly you can have ded dedicated ones like the Shimano do a dedicated spot and mark a reel quite fast on retrieve because I'm fishing at long range quite often just going to go for the slightly bigger spool just to help me with the, the distance but otherwise that's the setup but as you can see that one there will that's the new one we've been developing that will put a marker 180 yards not a problem for that sort of setup so we'll give it a cast now and uh, we'll show it goes 120 yards very easy to a clip right let's give it a go here we go this is clipped up at 120 so we'll see how easy it is to, uh, to get 120 quite easily so here we go Wetted the braid there. If you're using braid, if it's dry braid, you tend to get away with it to be honest. A lot of times it's when you don't get away with it, you can, it can be quite costly. So, what I've done is wet it up a little bit, just chuck the rail in, the rod rings in, and then uh, we'll give it a whack. So, right, this is clipped up at 120. No fishing, makes it a little bit tangled, and away we go. Get a frap up. 